Hi, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Kyle. I am a wastewater treatment plant operator, and today I will be answering questions that you submit about wastewater treatment. So in order to become a wastewater treatment plant operator, you will need specific coursework in wastewater, math, or science as well as state required certifications. On top of that, for our safety, we are required to train in CPR, first aid, and chemical response procedures. I understand that some of you may be concerned with the smell associated with wastewater. Well, I'd like to tell you, it doesn't smell that bad at all. One of the smelliest places in the facility is supposed to be our primary tanks. But as you can see, there are covers on top of them. What that does is that traps the smells inside the tank and we have what's called biotrickling filters. What they do is they neutralize the air and send it back into the atmosphere. The rule of thumb are the three P's. Pee, poop, and toilet paper. Besides that, nothing else should be going down your drains or your toilet. That includes cooking oil, cooking grease, hair, eggshells, coffee grounds, and especially not baby wipes. Thank you very much for your questions, ladies and gentlemen. We hope you learned a thing or two, and happy Water Professionals Appreciation Week.